Uh, Robert Merrill, Beverly Sills. Yeah, yeah. How about Tom Seaver? Tom the, Seaver. Tom Seaver of the Chicago White Sox. You see, Placido is an avid baseball fan. Oh. He's a particular fan of Tom's and the White Sox. Now, Tom and Placido have become good friends. Yeah. So naturally, Tom thought up a way to trap Placido in a practical joke. And you know, the nice thing is he, he picked a nice little intimate setting to spring this joke. White Sox Park. <laughs> the victim. Placido Domingo. He's performing in Chicago, and he's come to the park to see his favorite baseball team. The accomplice, Tom Seaver. Now, he's going to bestow upon Placido a very special honor, that of honorary team mascot. Mm -hmm. This is the Windy City, Chicago, Illinois, and this is the home of the Chicago White Sox. Now, it's still early in the day, and the players are taking batting practice. Placido's here before game time at Tom Seaver's request. And here comes Tom out of the dugout to meet his buddy. Tim, how are you? How are you? Now, the fellow in the blazer and slacks is Paul Jensen. He's the director of public relations for the White Sox. Let's bring our uh, celebrity. Uh, yeah, we have a um, we have a celebrity we have a celebrity mascot which we do here. We would love for you to do it. We've had uh, uh, Mr. T has done yes. it. He lives here. He lives in the same building I live here in town. Bruce Springsteen has done it. Oh, sure. <laughs> a special uh, White Sox costume, to, which, uh, which we would like you to have. Come in and wave to the fans, and they know it's a celebrity uh, it's a celebrity mascot if you do it. We'd love to have you do it. Right. Terrific. Do it to well, let's, on great. let's walk out. Oh, we can do, do it, it today. We can do it right yeah, now. Got, yeah, this That's sounds like a big a honor to Placido. Oh, After all, all, other big stars have been a celebrity mascot. He thinks all he has to do is slip into a simple outfit. He has no idea what's in store for him. Oh, he's pitching against me. Thursday. Wait till you see this outfit. <laughs> but uh, now I really do. And here he is, the prestigious star of grand opera stages all over the world, a man who has sung before kings and queens. Ta da! <laughs> Tom Seaver's going to offer to get Placido a drink. We won't see Tom until the end of the joke. Hold a drink. Just stay on the track. Oh, I'm going in. You know what is really tough? It's really tough to walk with this. At the moment, a lady will ask for Placido's autograph. She's not an actress. She's a real fan. Where are you, little sock? Can I sign book? Yes. I mean, who are you? I am Placido Domingo. He's never had a crowd like this at La Scala. It is a good one now, to have this a picture. This is one of the real White Hi. Sox mascots. Inside the suit is actor Edward Blatchford. How are you? What are you doing? How am I doing? What do you mean? What, what do you mean? Doing? What am I doing? I'm rooting for the Sox. <laughs> Pardon me? It's only supposed to be one mascot out here. One mask? Me. I'm supposed to be the only mascot out here. But I'm going out immediately. Don't worry. No. In a moment, actor Mike Metzger <laughs> will appear dressed as a security guard. Yes. Are we discussing that? <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. Yes. Uh, yeah, you can't be out on the field. We can't have fans out on the field, you know. I'm well, sorry, but what are we going to do? What are you doing here, out here? Just Tom Seaver and Paul De Sandy. No, no, no. <laughs> this, the, the team has a mascot. And we can't have fans out on the field here. We're going to have to ask you Why to leave the field. Why don't you ask Tom Seaver? Why don't you ask Mr. Paul Jensen? Listen, a lot of fans, through you know, through the years, people come out on the field. They all say they know Tom Seaver. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it, it's it's understandable. It's you know, it's very nice. Do you know who I am? No, I don't. Who are you? Are you talking to me seriously? Seriously? <laughs> we can't we can't have fans come out here oh, on the field. I'm going out immediately. I I'm dying to go out. Let me show you. No, the way. no, no, don't show me the way. No, I, I have to go that way. No, I I'm going to have to get you off. The is about just to use his great to voice to call for help. No, I think we're okay. Uh, Paul. <laughs> I, listen, I, listen, I got my orders from the clubhouse. You know, they just told me I've got to take you off the field. They sent me, they sent me to come in this who, way. Who sent, no, this, I, I, listen, I'm just doing my Here's job. Here's the media like, oh, covering all this. They have no idea it's a practical Let's joke. Stay right here, please. I'm going to go check on this, please. and I'll come back. Please, all do right. that. All right. Do that. All right. Just call Paul Jensen and Tom, Tom Siva. <laughs> Is he kidding? <laughs> Was telling the folks about his run-in with the rival mascot. <laughs> the other guy also, he come very offended. He said, and what I'm doing here? Then, yes. Then he's the mascot, you know, the one I'm doing. <laughs> Is that part of the... Sir, the I just talked to them, and they don't know who you are. Come on. I follow you. Okay, I follow you. 
No, I don't follow you. No, no. <laughs> okay, <laughs> let him off sure. the hook. All right, I'll tell you what. You're not going to follow me, right? <laughs> no. You're going to stay right here yes. all night? Yes. Then you might as well look up at the scoreboard right now. Ah. That That's says it. Placido Domingo is on TV's bloopers and practical jokes. <laughs> No. <laughs> <laughs> Even the organist is in on the joke. <laughs> I told you that you were going to Tom back. Seaver is finally coming back here in just a second. What are you doing that silly outfit for, for crying out loud? That's the silly oh. thing I ever saw. I've had the time of my life. I mean, he was trying to kick me out first. And I said, I am a very good friend of Tom Seaver. He said, oh, shit, everybody says they're a very good friend of Tom Seaver. <laughs> Next, you'll see how superstars got their start.